Hi, and welcome back to Jordan and Cork. I'm Maggie Cruz. And I'm John Duckett. And today we have a request from Michael Shu on YouTube, and we are opening the 2000 Jordan Cabernet. So the reason we're using the Corvan this morning is because we actually don't have any 2000s in 750 format anymore. So we thought we'd bring some bottles out from John Jordan's personal collection and open one with the Corvan this morning. The beauty of the Corvan is it allows you to open the bottle, grab a little bit, taste it, and then seal it back up and it gasses it and keeps the wine nice and fresh. Um, we at the winery have tested this up to about four weeks or a month and the wine is still really nice and bright and fresh. There's a lot of nice fresh fruit on the aroma. Yeah, a lot of dark cherry, some nice spice aromas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that barrel component's really starting to come out now. Yeah, still really fresh. Nicely balanced. Mm -hmm. 17 years old, smelling really nice. Beautiful long finish. Still really lively on the palate. Mm -hmm. A lot of fresh fruit flavors. Yeah, nicely integrated tannins. Mm -hmm. They've really mellowed out, mm -hmm. really softened up. It's tasting great right now. Like you said, yeah, nice long finish on this. I'm a little surprised by how 2000s tasting, just because of the, it was a good vintage, but wasn't a spectacular vintage. Mm -hmm. um, it was a little bit uh, larger, higher yields, bigger fruit clusters, which usually means a little bit less concentration, but I'm not really getting that from the wine at this age. Yeah, yeah. I don't know about you, but I'm always, I don't know about surprised, but just uh, excited about how well these, these wines age. You know, you're tasting a 2000 and it doesn't taste old to me. Mm -hmm. uh, still really lively, still really nice. Um, it's, it's just a, it's a pleasure drinking these. It's, it's a fun video to do. For our wines, we always talk about food pairings, but this is has enough age to it that I think this Cabernet can stand on its own. It's yeah. not too intense. It's not overwhelming. No, it's not nice too and much soft. tannin. Um, mm -hmm. Well balanced at this point. Yeah. You could definitely drink this by itself. Yeah. Thank you to Michael for requesting this wine. I don't think we would have been able to taste it otherwise since no. we don't have any 750s available. So this is special for us and I uh, hope everyone enjoyed it. So keep those comments coming and we'll see you on the next episode of Jordan Uncorked. Cheers. Cheers.